Hi guys, my name is Amanda Pina. I'm from Kansas City, Missouri, and I'm on staff here with YWAM Ships Kona. I did my DTS here at YWAM Ships Kona in January of 2016, and I went on outreach to Germany and Togo, which is in West Africa. So I had been on staff for a while here, and I was working in one of our offices, and I was um, getting ready to take a time off to do a secondary school here, and I was filling out some paperwork for that, and um, one of the questions was, what ministry are you gonna be a part of after this school, and who is gonna be the ministry lead? And kind of without thinking, I wrote like, July DTS John Mark Wheeler, and I was like, oh, I wonder why I did that and uh, just went back, took it back to the Lord, um, prayed about it, talked with John, Mark, and Caitlin, and felt like this is where I was supposed to be for this time. Um, my favorite aspect of staffing the DTS is doing one-on-ones, so I have three students this school that I meet with once a week, um, and just kind of there for them when they need to process anything, and um, help them just kind of through the school, praying for them, um, and doing all of that. I love just students coming here and getting freedom and that's like my favorite thing to walk people through and it's such a privilege to be able to do. The school's going so good. I'm so excited about this school. Um, our students are amazing um, and it's just such an honor being here with them. I think I've really enjoyed seeing them grow in their prayer life. So some of them, even like three weeks ago, when I asked them to pray out loud, they were like, no, I don't really want to do that. And now they're like praying out loud and proclaiming things over people. And it's so fun seeing them grow in that. Um, I'm really excited about going to Papua New Guinea. We're going to be on our medical ship and I have been working with our medical ship team for the last six months um, and I haven't been able to go on it yet. So I'm really excited just to see how it like actually affects the remote and isolated people groups.